line back up. literally engaged the brake and said apply brake and now it won't let me hardly back up what the I'm going to turn park assist off Rear park. Sensor is not available. Blocked. Yeah, that's fine. narrow road here and I'm gonna try and get started backing up once the road clears hopefully this damn thing doesn't come on again but I have a feeling it will and... yep it really will not let me back up reverse brake assist. So it's like it tries to stop me. Luckily it's letting me go slowly, but boom, just did it again. Foot's not even on the brake guys. And it just did it again. Like this is so frustrating. I have to override it. And tell it that I'm trying to back up. If you'll let me. Seems to be working. Rear parking sensor is not available. Sensor's blocked. Yeah, because there's a trailer back there. So somehow, I mean, I've got to be able to find out how to disable this. Because that's just, it's crazy. My, my trailer's plugged in. It's not wet, hasn't rained in a few days now. And uh, so I don't know why the sensors would be having an issue, but I'm gonna go talk to the customer and we'll see where we're at here. See, I can't stay on this road too long. How's it going, Zola? Pretty good. I'm, uh, I'll back in here if that works. Yeah, my truck's giving me issues. It, it keeps braking the truck, saying that um, the reverse brake, like the parking sensors are blocked. I'm like, yeah, there's a trailer behind it. Oh. And so it keeps automatically braking me. That's it's so weird. weird. It's like a sensor is, is uh, off. So I don't know. It's letting me do it. But if you see this trailer stop all of a sudden, that's what's going on. So I've been taking my time coming back down here because it keeps doing that. But I'll, I'm gonna pull forward a little bit and then I'll cut it over here. I should be okay. 
Thank you, Dale. Fairly tight, but we all right. So, got some metal over here we're gonna scrap. This pile here, we'll take the scrap yard. Spa cover, miscellaneous junk here. That's a window from her van she cut out. Got this pile here, those doors up against there, and then this pile here. So, shouldn't be too bad. I think what I'm gonna try and do is set you up on the shed see if I can't get a nice little angle up there for the camera. We'll try it anyhow. See if it works.
Looking pretty good here. She said she want to keep these. And uh, we'll just ask her about that stuff. I think we got it all. That's part of the fence, I believe. We're going to check that she took down right here so we can get through. So, and I'm going to ask her about that. I don't know if she wants that to go. Also, I'm going to ask her about this. I think she has a landscaper coming, so I don't think we're going to take that, but we'll see. Let's see what the road looks like. So, a little more. It's more than a half trailer. About three quarters. Alrighty guys, well, Apple CarPlay yet again, uh, connected wired and it doesn't, it's not responding to anything, no input, it's stuck on this screen. Um, I don't know why this happens, but I'm connected with the cord and it's still uh, getting bogged down. It's like nothing's working. So uh, Ford, WTF man, just the little electronic things. It's uh, pretty frustrating for me.